The Winooski Farmer's Market looked a little different this weekend. The Onion City honored its past and its connection to our neighbors to the north. Fox 44's Malachi Flynn was there and tells us how Canadian culture was celebrated. Sunday was French Heritage Day in Winooski and the Farmer's Market hosted a variety of French food and activities for visitors to try. In addition to the usual Farmer's Market vendors, Sunday's event included some special additions to honor Winooski's French-Canadian heritage. Uh, French Heritage Day is always a big day at the market. We have special guest vendors here. It's just a celebration of all of the French heritage in the area and the Quebecois culture that comes down from Quebec um, and just our, our close ties to, to French heritage in, in Winooski. Visitors could try their hand at French-style painting, called en plein air, eat crepes, try speaking French, and visit the French genealogy experts to learn more about their heritage. Guests could also learn more about Winooski's French-Canadian history in the Winooski Heritage Mill Museum. The city was heavily settled by Quebecois immigrants looking for work, and many found it at the Champlain Mill. We at the Heritage Winooski Mill Museum tell the story of the people who worked the mills and many of them were French Canadian. We have exhibits about the mill and some of them are not just in English but also in French. Uh, we have an activity where you can match both French and English textile terms together. The museum and the Winooski Historical Society see French Heritage Day as a way to reconnect with the city's history and educate its current residents about their predecessors. There is so much um, French Canadian and Franco-American history throughout New England and a lot of it has vanished. And so it's really nice to have a living tradition that we're carrying on here, even if it's for just one day, to remember what was the people who came before us and those who are still here and give them an opportunity to kind of have some pride. The main event was of course the annual Tortier contest and a new French bread baking contest, complete with ribbons and cash prizes. A panel of lucky judges got to sample each of the entrees before awarding the first, second, and third place prizes for each category. After the winners were announced, visitors jumped in to finish off the tortillere and bread left over by the judges. Reporting in Winooski, Maliki Flynn, Fox 44 News.